Today I'm at Discovery Children's Museum in Las Vegas, Nevada. This place has so many fun things to learn about. I love learning about art and science by tinkering with things to see what'll happen. <laughs> That's called an experiment. Yeah, let's do cool experiments together. One, two, three, four. Are you ready to explore? Great, let's go. Whoa, water world. I bet there are some cool experiments here. Let's move our bodies like water. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, look at this tall tower. I bet it does something really cool. The ramps help move the water down to these two big circles. Check it out. One circle is yellow and the other is orange. Ooh, the yellow one is moving a lot faster than the orange one. And look, let's count the ramps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ramps. Oh, and look, some balls. Huh, I wonder what'll happen if we put the ball in here. Let's try it. Whoa! Check it out! The green ball is moving on the ramp! Let's see where it goes! Wow! It's a ball pit! There are so many colorful balls in here! Red, and yellow, and green too! <laughs> that was so amazing! Water can do so many things! Like make sounds. What is that sound? Let's go find out. <laughs> wow! Check out these musical chimes. Huh, I wonder how we can make it make music. Let's experiment and find out. <gasps> Do you hear that? <laughs> yeah! The water is hitting the ball in the chimes and making music. Clink, 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 clink. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> oh, and look at this one over here. Hmm, these chimes are a little different. I wonder what sounds they'll make. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> Whoa. oh it makes a sound when it's in the water, too. Sounds like a rushing river. <laughs> okay, let's flow over there. <laughs> Whoa, check out these wheels. Hmm, they have different shapes. I wonder what that means. <laughs> I got it, let's do a race. All right, back it up, back it up. Are you ready? On your mark, get set. And they're off. All right, they're going fast. Wow, the one with the cups is going much faster. <laughs> cool. Hey, I wonder what that is. Whoa, I wonder what these are for. Hmm. <gasps> Check it out. This one looks like slices of pizza. I'd like a slice. <gasps> <laughs> Let's see what happens when we do this. Oh, wow! It turns the water into different shapes and it comes out different ways. Let's try this one next. <laughs> Check it out! It's a fountain! <laughs> the harder I press, the higher it goes! Whoa! <laughs> nice! <laughs> oh, and look at these wheels! Hmm, I wonder what happens if we spin them. Wow, do you see those bubbles? Cool. Let's spin them together. Oh, it frick, it frick, it frick, it. DJ Mika coming to a pool near you. <laughs> wow, look at the water. It's 
spinning around and around and around. <gasps> this is a whirlpool. It's kind of like a tornado, but with water. A tornado has air spinning around, and a whirlpool has water. Hey, let's pretend to be a whirlpool and spin around. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, I'm a little dizzy. <gasps> oh, let's see what'll happen when we put this red ball in there. Ready, set, go! <laughs> wow! It went woo -woo -woo all the way to the bottom. Let's try two balls now. Yellow and red. In you go. Wow! <laughs> Ooh, let's try three balls now. One red, one green, and another red. There you go. Ready, set. <laughs> do you think we should try four? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Here we go. Are you ready? Are you set? Whirl away! <laughs> Wow, that was so cool. Okay, let's whirl over there. Do you see the yellow car behind me? I wonder how it works. Hmm, oh look, it has blue straps that are attached with hooks. I think the blue straps are so you can lift the car up. <laughs> Whoa, oh look, pick it up lever, <laughs> yeah. This must be a lever experiment. Ooh, let's go check it out. The bar balances the weight so that you can lift it with little effort. <laughs> oh, should we lift this car with the lever? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh, I wonder what'll happen when I pull this rope. Let's see. Whoa! lifted the car all by myself. Yeah, that was awesome. We did it, we did it. We never ever quit it, we did it. <laughs> wow, levers are pretty cool. Hey, check out those stairs. I wonder where they lead. Let's go find out. Oh. This is a music room. Did you know when you hear a sound, it moves through your ear canal and makes vibrations that tell your brain what you're hearing? <laughs> yeah, very cool. And look, this room has so many things we can make music with and different sounds. Let's give it a try. <gasps> I wonder what would happen if we press this yellow button. <laughs> Let's find out. Whoa! Check it out! This has air! Let's put it over here. Look! It's a music note. The note E. <laughs> Let's try this green one. Oh, that's the note F. Okay, Blue, what do you have? Archie! Okay, Purple. the orange one. D. That's a low note. <laughs> and another C. <laughs> wow, that was cool. Look, do you know what this shape is? That's right, it's a triangle. Triangles have three sides. One, two, three. And they can make music too. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. Oh, that sounds awesome! <laughs> Check it out! This is so colorful. Hmm, what happens if we hit this with this yellow stick? Let's see. Oh, another note! Wow, let's drag it across. So cool. Whoa, 
Whoa! Look, it's drums! Hmm, let's count how many drums there are. One, two, three, four, five drums! Oh, this beat makes me wanna move my feet. Hey, I got it! Let's make a song. I'll give us a beat. Hey, I'm Lika, and I'm here to say I love exploring and figuring away. Hey, give it a shot, try it out, see what it's about. <laughs> Drum roll, please, for the grand finale. Yeah! Whoa, this place is so colorful. <laughs> I bet they have lots of things to tinker around with here. <laughs> What's this? Hmm, it kind of looks like a chalkboard. Let's confirm. <laughs> yep, a chalkboard. <laughs> Great job, scientist. <laughs> <gasps> and look, it rotates. That means it spins. Let's spin and draw. That was fun. Let's keep exploring. <laughs> wow. Let's draw on this. <laughs> Whoa. Look. <laughs> Do you know what color this is? <laughs> yeah, yellow. One of my favorite colors. Ooh, let's erase now. <laughs> oh, erase. Now let's draw with this color. Do you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, blue. Hmm, let's see if you can guess what this is. Can you guess? Yeah, they're waves, just like down in Waterworld. <laughs> okay, what else did we draw? <gasps> hey, I know. Let's draw some shapes. <laughs> I like yellow. Do you know what this is? <laughs> yeah, a triangle, just like when we were playing the triangles. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> okay, how about this one? Yeah, it's an oval. <laughs> okay, one more. <laughs> Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> That's right, it's a shining star. <laughs> okay, let's erase and keep exploring. <laughs> Whoa, what's this? Oh, we can build something out of these pieces. <laughs> let's give it a try. Ooh, I wonder what's in here. <laughs> Whoa! This is really bendy. <laughs> Ooh, let's make another bridge. Two bridges. <laughs> Ooh, let's make a third bridge. Wow! Okay, those connect there. Hmm, I think I need a couple more pieces. This'll work. One more. <laughs> there we go. Whoa, look at all these bridges. <laughs> Let's go through it. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I've got it. Let's make a flower garden. <laughs> Ooh, this could be a rose. <gasps> and this can be a daisy. <laughs> Perfect little flower garden. <laughs> Check out all this art. <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> Look, a beach ball. <gasps> okay, I'm going to throw it to you, friend. Ready, set. Oh, awesome catch. Okay, throw it back to me. Whoa. <laughs> Good job. Check out these instruments. Let's play them. <laughs> oh, and look, a guitar. Pluck, pluck, pluck. Ding, 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 ding. Do you see?
see that dog? <laughs> yeah, it must be someone's pet. Oh, good girl. <laughs> well, that was fun. <laughs> Whoa, this place is amazing. We learned so much by doing experiments and trying things out for ourselves. We played with water. We lifted a whole car with a lever. And we tinkered around with some music and art. We did a lot. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. OK, friends. See you later. Bye-bye. Woo! Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we are at O2B Kids in Orlando, Florida. I'm so excited to be here because I love science and I get to do a science experiment right here. Will you do one with me? Awesome. Let's see how we can get started. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. I'm Trudy, and welcome to ODBK's new learning playground. Hi, Trudy. Nice to meet you. Well, nice to meet you. So I heard that I could do a science experiment here and make elephant toothpaste. We love elephant toothpaste, and we've actually put together a scavenger hunt for you. What? That sounds so fun. Will you go on a scavenger hunt with me? <laughs> cool. So how do I start? You're all checked in and ready to go. Oh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Check it out. We're at the science lab. For this science experiment, we need to find six items in our scavenger hunt. We need to find hydrogen peroxide, safety goggles, dish soap, food coloring, measuring cups, and yeast. <laughs> okay, can you help me look for these items? Great, let's go. Whoa! Mind gym. Whoa, this must be a room for your mind. <laughs> wow! This is so cool. I recognize some numbers here. Will you count with me? <laughs> okay, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, that's so fun. Oh, okay, I don't see any items yet for our science experiment. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's kind of like a musical instrument. <laughs> see all these different colors? Oh, look, there's little items in here that you can find. Oh, looks like a balloon and a little fuzzy ball. Ooh, <laughs> this is fun. Cool. <gasps> Hydrogen peroxide. We found our first item for our science experiment. Hydrogen peroxide can help heal a cut, but you do not want to get this in your eyes. So we need to find safety goggles. Okay, good job. We have our first item. Check it out. A word find. So this big puzzle has a bunch of words in it, but they throw other letters in it to mix it all up. So it's kind of hard to see the words. See if you can find any words in here. You have to look really close. Oh, I found one. <laughs> look. P-E-A-R, pear. Ooh, that's a really yummy fruit. Any other words that can maybe give us a clue to the things that we're looking for? Oh, what about this word? Safety. Safety, like safety goggles? Maybe there are safety goggles around here. Oh, look, there's some letters down here. <gasps> Do you know what letter this is? <laughs> it's the letter M for Mika. And it's one of my favorite colors. The color yellow. <laughs> we did it. We found safety 
goggles. Safety goggles are really important when you do experiments because they protect your eyeballs. <laughs> All right, two items down, four to go. Safety goggles and hydrogen peroxide. All right, let's keep looking. <gasps> oh, whoa, it's like a grocery store or a market in here. <gasps> Look at all of this play food. Oh, cool. It looks like it's organized by color. I see green and orange and yellow. Ooh, what is in here? A cucumber slice. I love cucumbers. Oh, and a green apple. That's a nice healthy fruit. And one of my favorite vegetables, broccoli. <laughs> Ooh, and a tomato slice. These are all really healthy foods. Yeah, fruit and vegetables, they have nutrients and vitamins in there. So they're what I like to call an all the time food. They help you grow. Ooh, what's this? Some pizza. Mmm. <laughs> hey, let's see if we can find anything that we need for our science experiment. Whoa! This is like a little restaurant or a diner. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Put a little ketchup on here. Mmm. <laughs> Pretty tasty. Let's see if there's anything in here. <gasps> I found yeast! We need yeast in our science experiment. If you add warm water to yeast, it helps things rise. In fact, you need yeast to make bread. That's right! Hey, we are doing a great job on the scavenger hunt. Let's put this with our other things and then we can keep looking for more items for our experiment. <laughs> Good job. Let's keep looking. Okay, let's keep looking for more items for our science experiment. Whoa, there's a lot of fun things in here. Come over here. Whoa, look at these big blocks. Huh, let's see. What can I make here? Okay. Hmm. Feels pretty sturdy. It could be a new chair. <laughs> put this on it and this. Or it could be a throne. Queen Hamika. <laughs> oh, I still don't see anything for our science experiment. Hmm. Maybe there's something over here. Hey, a hula hoop. Check it out. Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> That's right, it's a circle. And it's the color green. Let's see if I can hula hoop. <laughs> Let me try again. Ready, set, hula hoop, hula hoop. Oh, that was a little better. Look, you can also put it on your arm like a giant bracelet and swing, 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 swing. <laughs> but you know what? This is not something that we need for our science experiment. Fun though. Hmm. Oh, this is a really cool game. Look, you have a spinner and it tells you where to put your body on the dots. Left foot yellow, see? Left foot yellow. Hmm. Left foot yellow. Let's see if I can do one more turn on here. Whoop. This is left hand green. <laughs> Whoa. Need to try not to fall down. <gasps> I might fall down soon. <laughs> That's okay. All right. Hmm, come over here. <gasps> Whoa, do you know what this is? It's a bottom of a slide. Should I go down the slide? 
Okay. Oh, wow, it looks like it's really high up. I wonder if there's anything at the top that we can use for our science experiment. I can't wait to make elephant toothpaste. <laughs> it says socks only. That means I need to take my shoes off. All right, let's, oh, they go in these cubbies over here. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to the top and see if I can find something for our experiment. See you at the bottom. Oh, <laughs> hi. <gasps> I think I see something for our experiment. I'll see you soon. Woo! <laughs> Look what I found. Dish soap. We definitely need this for our experiment. Oh, I'm so excited. Thanks for your help. All right. I'm gonna grab my shoes and our other items for our experiment and we can keep looking. We have two more to find. Come on. Hello. <laughs> Let's keep looking. <gasps> cool clock. <laughs> Whoa, look over here. It says A-R-T, art. <laughs> This is an art space. <gasps> cool, look at this big piece of paper. Oh, I could color something on here. Ooh, look at all of these markers. I'm gonna choose purple because it's one of my favorite colors. <laughs> all right, let's, what should I draw? Ooh, I know, see if you can guess. It's a science flask. You can use this in a science experiment, <laughs> but it kind of looks like something else. What do you think? Okay, I'll give you a hint. Do you know now? <laughs> it's two eyes and a nose. <laughs> what else does it need? Oh, right, a mouth. Give it a big mouth, a big smile. Hello. <laughs> oh, there's crayons too. Maybe I could put something else on here and choose a different color. Let's see. Um, oh, I found the food coloring. Look. <laughs> oh, and it's my two favorite colors, purple and yellow. We're getting closer and closer to finding everything we need for our science experiment. One more item to find. Come on. Whoa. <laughs> hey, look at this. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> cool bee. Wow, it looks like this bee's measuring something. <laughs> hey, Mr. Bee, I like your style, purple and yellow. Two of my favorite colors. <laughs> hey, it looks like we even have the same kind of shoes. <laughs> <gasps> Measuring cups. That's the last thing we need for our science experiment. We found everything. Let's head into the science lab. Come on. Hey, Trudy. Hi, Mika, welcome back. Thank you. I think that I found all of the items I need for the science experiment. Yay, may I see them? Oh, yeah. I have safety goggles, hydrogen peroxide, dish soap, food coloring, <laughs> yeast, and measuring cups. Congratulations, Mika, you are ready for the experiment. <gasps> wow, really? There you go. Oh, thank you so much. An official lab coat, awesome. Enjoy, thank you. <gasps> I'm so excited to do this experiment. Okay, everyone, safety first. <laughs> if you're doing this experiment at home, please make sure to do it with a grown-up. We are going to make elephant toothpaste. But remember, it's not really toothpaste, so please don't use it on your elephants. <laughs> the first step is we need to pour half a cup of hydrogen peroxide into this glass. Okay, 
and be nice and careful and pour it to the top. Okay. Step one, complete. Second, we need our dish soap. Okay, a squirt of dish soap in there. And you swirl it around, make sure it mixes a little bit together. Okay, that looks pretty good. And now, I'm going to add two of my favorite colors, purple and yellow. Okay. Get a little goop there. It looks black, but once it all mixes together, it's going to look purple. And yellow. And look, the yellow looks orange. But once it comes out of the cup, it's going to look yellow. Okay. All right. Next, we are going to add our yeast to some warm water. And I already have some warm water right here. And you only need one teaspoon. So let me open this up and get one teaspoon of yeast. Okay. There we go, one teaspoon, add it to the water, and stir it around. See, it's all mixing together, okay? And then we're gonna add it to the glass, and hopefully we will see our toothpaste in action. It's going to the top. Did you see some of the colors? Wow, it really looks like toothpaste. <laughs> oh, science is so much fun. Isn't that cool? Whoa, it's still going. Whoa, <laughs> there are the colors right there. Oh, that was so fun. Hey. Thanks for helping me find all of those items for our science experiment. You were very helpful. <laughs> science is so fun. And we had a lot of fun today, right? We went on a scavenger hunt. We did a word puzzle. Oh, I went down a really cool green slide. And there was a pretend grocery store and art. <laughs> we did a lot today. All for the love of science. <laughs> well. That's the end of this video. If you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Cool. <gasps> Should we spell it on the planet? Science style. <laughs> Let's do it. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> Thanks for learning with me. See you soon. <laughs> It's me, Mika, and today I'm at Bubble Pop in Orange County, California. Have you ever played with bubbles before? <laughs> They're so much fun! Maybe you've used a wand and blew bubbles into the air, or maybe you've taken a bubble bath. <laughs> it's so fun! Well, at Bubble Pop, we get to play with bubbles all day long. Will you play with me? Oh, let's go! Whoa, check it out, bubbles. And, hey, do you know what this is? <laughs> a bubble wand. Whoa, and this one has a lot of circles on it. I wonder if that means it will make a ton of bubbles. Let's find out. Okay, get some solution on there. <sighs> huh. I'll just try again. <laughs> Two out. Do you hear that? There's air blowing out from these two places here. That must mean if I take the bubble solution, put it on the wand, and then put it on the fan. <laughs> That's so cool. Let's do it again. Whoa, <laughs> look how many bubbles. Hey. Here's another bubble wand. It looks just like this one, but there's something different. That's right. There's a yellow circle right here in the middle. Hello. All right, let's try this one. <gasps> Whoa, even more bubbles.
doubles. Wonder if I could do two at the same time. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. Whoa! So many bubbles! Whoa, I'm gonna do it again. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Wait a second. I have an idea. Check this out. See, there's a bunch of squares in here. Kind of looks like a big waffle. What would happen if I put some bubble solution on this and put it on the fan? Ready? Three, two, one. Wow! It kind of looks like the bubbles you would see when you're getting a bubble bath. I'm gonna do it again. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> bubbles are so much fun. I wonder what else we can do here. Come on. Whoa, look, even more bubbles. Whoa, but check out this bubble wand. It's a big yellow circle. One of my favorite colors. <laughs> See if I can make a bubble. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I caught it. <laughs> Do it again. <gasps> wow, that was a big bubble. <laughs> oh, hi. Hi. I'm Teresa from Bubble Pop. Hi, Teresa. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. Hi, Mika. I'm so glad that you're playing with our bubbles. Yeah. Can I show you some bubble tricks? Oh, yes, please. All Let's right. see. So I saw you making a bubble. Uh huh. All right. So we're gonna make the bubble kind of like you just did and then catch it just like you Ooh. did. Whoa. Whoa, you have three <laughs> or more bubbles on your wand. Check it out. <gasps> Our bubbles came together what? and made a huge one. Whoa. <laughs> wow, bubbles All are right. awesome. What is a bubble? Well, I'm glad you asked, Mika, because you can see right here. See this film mm -hmm. on the wand? Yeah, it's like shiny. Yeah, it's our bubble solution. So usually bubble solutions are made of soap and water mm -hmm. and usually something else that's a polymer that will bind everything together. Water molecules love each other so much. They like to just hold hands and be really tight. And so they squeeze the soap molecule together. And that's why there's a thin film here that makes your bubble. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah. And when they do that, it's called cohesion. Cohesion. Yep, and that's what makes the bubble hold together just like this. Wow. <laughs> All right, you ready to do a bubble trick? Yeah. Okay, so because bubbles love each other so much, the water molecules inside a bubble, we can actually create a bubble inside this bubble. How? You wanna try it with me? Yeah. So I want you to blow very short first inside the bubble. <gasps> Whoa, do you see that? There's little bubbles in the really big bubble. Whoa! Whoa, <laughs> can I do that even in this little bubble? I think you can. Oh, I see a baby one. Yeah, <laughs> there's a tiny one right there. So instead of blowing bubbles inside a bubble, something else that cohesion allows us to do is put a bubble on any surface that we want to. Oh, okay. Like how about your hand? You want to try to catch one <gasps> yes, in your hand? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so I will make a bubble for okay. you, and then you try to catch it with your hand. All righty. I'm going to catch that bubble. Ooh, oh, that it was popped. So close. <laughs> it did pop. <laughs> so the most important thing about cohesion is that you need water molecules together, right? Is your, oh. Let me see your hand. It's oh, just it was, a little wet. It was kind of dry. Yeah. Let's try it with a bunch of water molecules on it and then they can link together. Woo, okay. Get all the solution on my hands. Yes. I'm ready to catch this bubble. Okay, I am going to throw one at you. Oh, you did it, you caught it. I caught a bubble. Wow, that's Hello. so cool. Let me see if I can even pop it, but I wet my hand. So I think the water 
is gonna like each other, <gasps> and I can put my hand inside what? your bubble. Teresa, you're a bubble magician. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> was that cool? That was amazing. Do you wanna see other cool bubble tricks? Yes, I do. Okay, come on, let's go. Right, come with us. Mika, wow. let me show you this oh. phantom bubble station. Phantom bubble station? Yes. Do you oh. remember before how we made a bubble with just air in it? Mm hmm All right. Well, this one, we're going to make a bubble, but it's going to be filled with something besides air. Oh, what is it going to be filled with? Do you know what dry ice is, Mika? Yeah. <laughs> so dry ice is made of carbon dioxide, which is already in our air. We would just breathe it normally. But what they do is they make it really, really tight so that it get things really, really cold. Oh, and way colder than the ice you would find in your refrigerator. Yeah, that's right. It's negative 100 <sighs> degrees Fahrenheit. That's super cold. In fact, it's so cold, it's not really safe to touch. Mm -mm. So we never want to touch it. So what we do is we keep it nice and safe inside here. Mm -hmm. But what comes out is the sublimated form of carbon dioxide, oh. which is this smoke that we see. Isn't yeah. that neat? So we can put it here in our bubble solution. We turn it and it can trap the, the fog inside the bubble. Oh, and look. now you have a smoke-filled bubble. That's really neat. Yeah. It was kind of like a crystal ball. Yeah, and you know what's really cool? Remember last time how we Put a bubble in your hand. Yep. Would you like a smoke-filled bubble in your hand? Yes, I would, thank you. All right, let's <laughs> do it. All right, so do you remember the trick to how we always hold a bubble without popping it? Right, you don't want your hands to be dry. Mm -hmm. My hands are really dry right now, so I'm gonna put some bubble solution on them. So they get nice and wet. Perfect. Okay. All right, and I will help you put the bubble inside your hand. Okay. All right, here we go. Get it on here, hold on. Why don't we, there we go. Look at that. Whoa. Whoa, now you have a smoke-filled bubble in your hand. That's so cool. You can't even see through it. That's how much smoke is in mm -hmm. there. Can you make it dance? <laughs> oh, come on, bubble. Yes. Oh, this bubble has moved. <laughs> Did you know that carbon dioxide is actually heavier than regular air? Oh. Yeah, so when we fill the bubble, mm -hmm. we use only carbon dioxide. So all you see is the smoke that's inside. Yeah, you can't see through it or anything. Nope, but if we make a bubble and we have both air and carbon dioxide, oh. we'll be able to see which one's heavier. How does it get in there? So we're gonna use this and we're gonna stick it right inside oh. here. Thank you for your help, Mika. Yeah. All right, Whoa. do you see that? Do you see how at the bottom there's the fog, carbon dioxide smoke, and then mm -hmm. at the top you can see that it's just regular air. Right. So even though it's both air and gas, one is definitely heavier than the other. Yeah, and it's going to the bottom. Yeah, and then look, now you have a smoke-filled bubble. Oh. Whoa. Biggest bubbles I've ever seen. Ooh, Ooh. bubble hug. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Do you want to see something, Mika? Yeah. All right. I'm going to make <gasps> a bubble arch. It's like a rainbow. All right. I'm going to make one more just for you. All oh, right. Thanks. Here we go. <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. All right. Do you want to try? Yeah. Thanks. Oh. Oh, look how big this bubble wand is. It's bigger than my head. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, get some solution on there and... <gasps> Whoa. Wow, it's so pretty. That was awesome. Great job. Thank you. And thanks for teaching me about bubbles and showing me all these cool bubble tricks. Yeah, no <laughs> problem. I hope you're having a great time. Oh, yeah. Have fun. All right, I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Whoa. <laughs> she knows a lot about bubbles. All right. I'm gonna do another arch. Ready? Three, two, one. Arch! Oh. <laughs> I wonder what else I can do with this big bubble wand. Whoa, look! It looks like a magnifying glass. Hello! 
<laughs> Whoa! Did you see that one? Oh, that one popped really fast. Whoa, that one popped fast too. I wonder if I can make one that will stay and float a little bit. that bubble tower that I made. Oh, and my favorite was the big bubble arch. That was so much fun. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> well, thanks so much for learning with me today. <gasps> A bubble dance party! Let's dance!